I was angry yesterday and couldn't talk to you. But I heard all you said. My wife also talked some things into my head last night. So I decided not to wait for you to come. I've come to also apologize for everything that I've done against you. Thank you very much, my brother. Thank you. As regards that throne, it's obvious that you have a better standing than myself. I don't know what you gave to everybody, but while I was trying to have my way, I just discovered that they all have given you their support and heart. Sir, is more here to see you? Which is Amo? Udoka. I'm busy. I'll see him later. Yes, sir. Well, you should have seen him. Could be something very important. What is more important than making peace with my brother? Nothing. I want to salute your courage for making peace. It takes a man to say I'm sorry. I think this is the beginning of our brotherly love and I salute you for taking the bold initiative. You know, they say it's good and it's pleasant for brethren to dwell together in unity. Exactly. And I really am happy about this. Brethren? Barbara? Yes, baby. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. Was about bringing her to you. Is she the one we'll be waiting for? Yes, sir. This is great. There's a girl Clifford wants to marry. You certainly did not make the wrong choice, boy. Thank you, sir. And since my brother confirms you've made the right choice, let's go ahead. What I said earlier still stands. Commence with arrangements. Tell your people. Revert to me. I will get it off from there. I understand. Thank you very much, sir. All right, then. Um, you also made the right choice as regards what I wanted from you. Cliff, what are you talking about? See, they think as the only child that I should get married as soon as possible. Come here. <laughs> Barbara. <laughs> I could still see the look of surprise on the poor boy's face as we were leaving. What did you expect? We had gone to him with our different propositions. That gave him the impression that we are each other's throats. And then he sees us together. That will give confusion to any person. What? I'm sure he got the message that we are now one. And whatever promise you gave to him, is wrong with it. Exactly. And this same message should go to everybody in our kind of community. Especially those that want to capitalize on our misunderstanding to cause more damage to the family. Mm -hmm. And anyone who wants to cause any disaffection between us again has us to contend with. <laughs> Ah. 
Clifford, you didn't tell me that we are expecting a visitor. A very beautiful one for that. How are you, my dear? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Uncle, I know you must be very tired, very, very tired, and you are coming from a long meeting. Why don't you sit down and relax your weary bones first? Can you imagine that? You are telling me that my bones are weary. I stood on my feet on the parade <laughs> when I was with 31 infantry. Uncle, Uncle don't, don't, don't just start without your old army, old army stories. Please, please don't just start. Sit down first. My dear, what's your name? I'm Barbara Okorode from Umungu. Oh, good. She actually from Umungu. Oh, from Umungu. I, I know one family from Umungu. Um, are you the daughter of Monica Okorude? She was a teacher. Yes, sir. Yes, I am. She's my mom. Eh? <laughs> come, come, my dear. <laughs> and greet me well. Ah, uh, Good. Thank you. Have you offered her every good thing in the house? I've taken care of her very, very well. I actually... Baby, go. <laughs> I actually brought her to meet you. Okay. Sit down, my dear. Yeah, so if now you want to sit down, you need to sit down before. This is interesting. My dear, how is your mother? She's fine, sir. Um, uh, Chilike, you and our man, hmm? go and tell Antonio that I said he should ride the people around town and buy you ice cream. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, just take this one. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you, Dad. Okay, okay. Yeah. Good. Ice cream. Be good, be good, guys. <laughs> That was what my father said. If you don't want to take us out, I will quietly go inside and tell him that you refuse to take us out. Was it your father or Chibike's father gave the instruction? I know. They want us to go out so they can discuss like grown up. If you don't, if you don't want to take us, we will go back and sit with them. And uh, come, let's go back inside. And where do you think you're going to? We are going inside to tell his father that you don't want to take us out. 
Okay. Okay, let me take you out. Bring the money. Yeah. No, we have it. And we can buy our things ourselves. Okay. Right, come. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Um, this is good news. We have realized that rivalry will cause us setbacks and divisions as a family. Therefore, we have decided to move on as one big indivisible family. We all know why the lady girl has not been buried. That's a huge problem we have on our hands. The good news is also that he'll be buried without any human hands. <laughs> this is more like it. <laughs> After the burial, we will, as one big family, intensify all effort to ensure that we get to the root of the disappearance of Chukwe Buka and his grandmother. Um, thank you very much, Adimola. From henceforth, we will work together in this family as one. Mona Adimola. From today, only and this guy came over. You are the one that came over. I am the one that came over. Um, I'm sure these two glasses are not for you. Mm. Oh well. One belongs to me. And the other belongs to someone very special. Mm. Mm. Okay, so what are you looking for here? I came to see you privately. You know, everyone is happy with the new development. Just like me. Demora is very stubborn and I know that if it weren't for you, this piece will still be a mirage. Oh well, actually I did what I had to do. But seriously, it was his decision to make up with you. Thank you very much. I owe you big time. And to show my appreciation for your contribution, this glass belongs to that wow. special person is meant for me. Thank you very much. Uh, Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. Nice wine. <laughs> Udoka. 
Can you tell me that man is military? Why is it that I cannot drink water and drop the cup wherever I want in my house? What are you looking for in my house for the night? Why are you sneaking up in people's houses? Stop blabbing like a four-year-old child and listen to the voice of reason and wisdom. Obaleke. Voice of wisdom and reason. Where is it coming from, Obaleke? Your evil deeds are about to find you out. Udoka. Your redemption lies only in going to the village square and confessing your sins. What rubbish are you talking about? What nonsense are you talking about? Ishaba has spoken. I know it. I know it that from the day I emerged as the chief priest of Wakara, you've never been happy. But I tell you, you cannot do anything. You can't do nothing. Okay. I have delivered the message of Ishaba. You are a liar, Baleke. You are a liar, Baleke. Where was I when Ishaba revealed that to you? Ishaba recognizes me and not you, Baleke. You are fake. And your words are fake. You see, the God I serve does not want you to fight anybody. Just be still and see how the glories of your life are defeated. I told your brother this and he insisted I tell you myself. The people you seek are now dead and buried. What? They were used in a ritual that will ensure that someone without a blue blood will be made king. Pastor, I, are you saying that my mother and my... Oh. What, what, what is the meaning of this? Can somebody just tell me? Show me the girl he wants to marry. And I'll provide the ne yes, the needed forms when they are sent. Okay. Dado? Yeah. <laughs> 
What did you notice it? Oh, we coming from the palace. We all heard the same thing. Did you tell it to your friend? No, no, no. Yes, yes. I don't want it. I don't want it. Usama, Usama, give me wine. Usama, give you wine. Yes, he gave me wine. Okay, okay. Let me take you to the hospital. Try and get, try and get off. Oh my god. Oh my god. time to go through these uh, documents yes I'm, I, I don't have problem with that you can take your time and go through it hmm? um, but I need to take you to the factory this morning yeah if you're ready I'm ready okay just give me some few minutes to to wear my shoe inside, so I was instructed not to let anyone in. Right. Is it true Sonia is dead? Yes, ma'am. She is. So, where is Ademora? He drove out a few minutes back with some elders. I don't know where he's going to.
Sonia. Sonia that was with us yesterday. What could have happened to her suddenly? What could have happened to her? It is not true. What baffles me is that she ate what everyone else ate and drank what everybody drank here in this palace. Why are we suffering from multiple that? But what have we done to deserve this? Hey, Chimo! Chimo! Okay. Now give me my son. But it's not possible. Okay. That's it. Hey! Sonia. I can't hey. believe that Sonia is there. It is not possible. It is not possible that Sonia is there. It is not possible that Sonia is there. Please help me. Okoye. Okoye. Okay. 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 What happened to Sonia? What do you think of? Eh? This place is fine. I, I, I like it. I like it. <laughs> this is just a tip of the iceberg. Hmm? Just do as you have agreed with him. And your life will never be the same. <laughs> okay. Ah, I, 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 can, I can see. I can. In fact, I've already done that. <laughs> hey, my phone. <laughs> Hello? Yes. Eh? Hey, hey, hey. Eh? Hey! What, 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 what Something that? terrible has happened in the village. Please, let's go. Come to console me after killing my wife? Hey. Ademora, what are you talking about? This is a very serious allegation to make. And who are those fools that let this murderer in here? Hey. Are you stupid? Now get out of my compound. Ademora, please calm down. Please calm down. Get out. Get out. Please calm down. You can see he's passing through a lot. Can you do as he said? Hey. Ademora, you're not being fair to me. Why would I kill your wife? I said get out! Please, calm down, Ademora. Don't tell me to calm down! Please, please, Ademora, please. It's okay, yeah, it's okay. okay. Take it easy. Please, please calm down. down. Let him get out! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What an embarrassment! What an insult! How could he insinuate that I killed his wife? Instead of getting his boss as a man, he's trying to see who to blame it on. 
I'm only come having second thoughts about making peace with that idiot. I've never been this embarrassed in my entire life. Can you imagine? Do you know they will be looking at us like murderers? Obviously. Obviously. When your own brother makes such accusations. Obviously. Sometimes in life, we have to do the needful. This your present sorrow, I assure you, will soon turn into an immense joy. Hmm? I took the boy to the factory and he accepted. In fact, he was so excited that he agreed to our plan. You know, I had to, you know, ease him off so I can come and talk with you. Eh? But let me assure you that very soon your sorrow will turn into immense joy. All you have to do is to be strong and courageous and prove to be more than an average man. All these things are just obstacles to stop you from getting the ambition you deserve. Hmm? All the same. Sorry for your loss. Sorry. Hmm? I have been watching you for a while now. There is something that is going on you are not telling me about. I want you to tell me everything. Okay, I don't understand what you're saying. No. You understand what I'm talking about. Tell me everything. Don't take it for granted. The legs that move fast could also be seen by the eyes that see fast. So tell me, what is your business with the Anosi case? Uncle, Uncle, nothing. It's just that they want me to offer them the throne of uh, uh, Okaro. But they have it already. Yes, they have it, but from all indications, it seems that uh, the Kingmakers and I believe that Shaka won't allow that to happen. So they want me to officially hand it over to them. So there won't be any repercussions. What is your decision on that? He asked me not to talk to anybody about that, that he's going to offer me the factory, which I've already seen, and give me some money to at least get married and have my own family. It is obvious that they will promise you heaven and earth. Did you promise them to hand the kingship over to them? Are you ready for that? I don't think that was what Adimora meant. He said he can't face the grief once again and wants to bury his wife. And I'm telling you it will not happen like that. Odu, let me finish. Let me finish before you misquote me. Eh? He did not say he wants to perform the burial rites of his wife. He only said he wants to bury her body. Yeah, but don't you eat in honey? And when the late Igwe is a burial rite and passage has been completed, he will now come and perform the burial rites of his of, 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 of Sonia, his wife. It is not a bad idea. Ah. And I wouldn't want that to cause us any problem. You see, we we, 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 are, we are going to give them our maximum support. Exactly. That is all the family needs now. So that to stay clear, to stay away from all the uh, evils that have befallen the, the family is too much. It is really a sad time for that family. The spirit of speaking out for the truth to reign. I will not put their tragedy behind the greed of the late Igwe and his bad life he lived. Who are we to judge? Oh, no. Who are we to judge? Hello. You're pissing. What is the problem? Actually, I don't know if this is the right time to talk about this. But 
one who is in pain must continue to cry out. Okay, what is the problem? I no longer sleep. I've tried everything. Everything I could have tried, but... But what? Is in name. Isn't this mother and her grandchild have continued to be a plague in my life? I meet them when I least expect. They wake me up. Uh -huh. I've been really scared with all the things that have been happening in this palace, but the latest is what I can afford to endure. Are you talking about the hearing noise at night? Do you hear that too? Of course. Do you know what? I used to think we have this big rat in this house. But you know what? I went to the kitchen one night to check out some things. I couldn't find any single rat, not even a small one. But when I, won, when I wanted to go out, the whole hairs on my neck stood still, and I knew something worse than rat is in that kitchen, you know? Ngozi, now you're beginning to scare me. Please, I'm not going to keep quiet anymore. I'm going to take his room, his highness. I'm not going to keep. Let's go. I don't think I can stay here any longer. Were you dreaming about my mom? Chibik, your mom has got to be with the Lord. Be a good boy, go back to sleep, okay? I'm going back to my room. Your daddy, anything. Did you kill Chibike's mommy? Amara, I am not a killer. I didn't kill her. And whatever puts that idea into your head, trust me, it's not a good one. Those girls came to me and complained that they hear noises inside this house every other night. 
And you remember when I told you that I saw my mother carrying my baby? So, I thought I should bring them to you so that they will explain things themselves. So, what exactly are you girls talking about? It's the noise of someone walking around in the night, Your Highness. And do you know who that may be? I don't know, Your Highness. Sometimes it seems the person is following you, Your Highness. Ebele. Yes, Your Highness. Do you have anything to say? I'm, I'm scared. I'm just scared of it all, Your Highness. Yes, Your Highness. It's so absurd. I mean, we're all scared. <sighs> okay, um... You girls, just go about your normal duties. Okay? We will take care of everything. Oh, thank you, Your Highness. You can go now. What do you think we should do? This is still a shocker to me. What is after you? Aji. I'm just on my way to your house. My house. Then let's go back. Um, I don't think there is need for that now. Actually, I'm in a very big trouble. I mean, the trouble, I doubt if my position as the SM of this land can still hold. It's costing me a whole lot of headache. Look, what is the problem? Actually, the best thing for us now is just to go and see Adamora. I guess that's the best thing for us to do now. Yes. Mm. He offered to give me a factory and a huge amount of money uh, in the exchange of the throne. What are you talking about? It is not complicated, my son. But I've already accepted the, the, the factory. Okay. You are old enough. But as an elder, I say what I know. So that the land we stand on will bear me witness. You are old enough. I don't know. Do you think I should reject it? You are a king in the making. Hmm? You are a king in the making. You are bound to make decisions. I mean, difficult decisions in difficult moments. You see, you soon sit on the throne. And the elders, the entire elders of Okano will be sitting, watching, and waiting for your decision. And... And what, you know? By the power in the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ, I come against any familiar spirit tormenting this house in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Sisters, as we've gone round this house, prayed for God's sustenance and protection. I believe Him. He 
that make it this life will never let us down. Amen. Pastor, what exactly could be responsible for what these girls are complaining? Mm. Well, the voices they complained about is not different from the one Her Majesty sees sometime. Pastor, are you telling me that the spirit of my son and that of my mother are roaming in this compound? <laughs> when familiar spirit have no place with the children of Almighty God, Amen. and by the power in the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ, this house is free from hunting. Amen. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I come against any principalities and powers, familiar spirits, ruining this compound in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You will be free, my dear daughter. You will be free, dear daughter. Let's go inside. Oh no, don't worry. How can a man survive if he does not give a conscious thinking to his actions? Ezemo, you're welcome. Thank you. Ezemo, let's go inside. Clifford, I will not go in. What happens to what is offered to you? The gods don't want to know. But what you have to offer is the priority of their immortal consideration. That is the message I waited to deliver. But I don't understand what is I should do. When you ask questions that don't have answers, expect no answer, my son. But as a more. and I have been having the same nightmare. Now we are sure of what the problem is. I will go home and fortify myself. I will be back here this evening to take care of this problem. Whatever has to be done, has to be done quickly. I don't want anything standing in the way of Adimora becoming the next king of Okaro. Do you hear me? I assure you that. Udoka knows better. The death of my wife is certainly not unconnected with the fact that somebody does not want me to sit on the throne. But I tell you, anyone that cannot be bought should be dealt with bitterly. Mwadike! Mwadike! There's nothing a wife can do that I have not done, but all to no avail. My husband is dying by installments. 
all because of the allegation of murder levied against him by his cousin. Hmm. I've had you, my daughter. But I want to ask, is your husband guilty of the allegation? No. Anyway, I have asked him severally and he has maintained his stance that he has no hand in Sonia's death. We were all together that night when Adimora said she ate whatever it was that she ate that killed her. We all ate the same food and drank the same wine. Mm. Now, your husband knows the right thing to do. He should have taken the right course if he fails that he's being accused unjustly. <laughs> now, there is nothing I can do for him. Because it will look as if I cry more than the bereaved. What should he have done? You see, allegation of murder is not taken lightly. It is expected that anybody accused unjustly to bring official complaints to the Council of Elders. That is the situation. Adobe, I just want to be left alone. Is it too much to ask for? This is too much to ask for. It is. You're here pining away because you were accused of killing your cousin's wife. Well, you should have gone to the Council of Elders to complain and for them to do something about the matter. Which elders? I don't want those elders that Ademora have bought over to stick their corrupt noses into my problem. Uzona, this is not just about you. It's about us. You, me, and our daughter. The earlier you wake up from your sleep of selfishness and treat this matter like a man, the better for us. What are you saying? So I'm no longer a man. When Ademora becomes the king, I would leave what he will do to you and I to your imagination. It is better you treat this matter decisively now or leave and suffer the consequences tomorrow. I'm a good doctor. As a mom, as a mom, I'm a fun year. When I'm going to have a winning swat. It's a mom, I'm going to swat. When I joke, if you wait, I'm going to go to Jane, Western Mazapata. You're crazy. Guess you have a bend the more on your own. No, it's a yano. Which is a yano. So, pardon. I want to marry you well when you're wrong. Maka no mother. Gage your woman, mother. Cow was of the mother case, yet Jay, you were well upon mother. Western Yano. And then you know one of one who chess are mad, Napoli Nemur and Carode. Kanjinaka, <laughs> Hey,
Want to rule? 